based after dark ladies and gentlemen welcome to the base after dark podcast season two episode 22 and we're correct we are here with me t papa slice we have zoe tasty hamzy nine rain and prison joe good morning How are we doing? yeah hey good morning hey, hey guys also, thank you, you to our oh, Patreon. You forgot the one. Sorry. Dude, hold there on, are three things no, you no, have no, to no, do. No, 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 no. I didn't forget. I didn't forget. I just did a longer pause than you guys thought I was going to do. It's still the intro. <laughs> and still the I intro. would like to segue that into uh, thank you to the Patreons that Patreon to us. <laughs> We love <laughs> the Patreon, 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 Patreon to us. Thank We're you. getting close <laughs> to 200 patrons, and when we get there, we will do another special podcast. Oh, we live, live special on Twitch, of course. Am Why I breaking my? Am I again. gonna break my four loco sobriety for this? This you should. Special. I think What's that's good on? incentive, guys. If we get to 200 patrons, Tasty will break his four loco sobriety. That's worth it. I think it's a good celebration, you know, to bring you know, for New good. Year. It that's might be like good. a New Year, New Me kind of thing. I haven't been drunk since the, since the last one. So. <laughs> That's so beautiful. I've you guys get drunk on Thanksgiving? Well too. Oh, uh, yeah. Big no, game. dude. I was fucked on. Not with alcohol, dude, though. Just my, uh, oh. <laughs> my family has slowly started to, like, you know, venture away from the Mormonism, dude. And they, they busted open champagne at wait, the Thanksgiving guys... dinner table. Wait, like, my mom not, and normal? my dad. No, the Mormons don't drink, dude. And they just. They just busted out the shit. Dude, my dad was just like pouring glasses for everybody, just like topping people off. I was Wait, like, T Papa, what's going on, man? Your, like, your family's wandering astray? <laughs> I guess so, dude. Did you they're, have a hand They're going to go to hell. You man. think they watch a podcast? Yeah. Maybe they watch a podcast. <laughs> Damn. Dude, my no, my sister, my sister's an avid listener. I've mentioned that a zillion times. She, you know, she listens the second it comes out. And I think. Every now and then she might show something to my mom. Like, my mom knows the podcast. Like my mom will meander in my stream. Like every now and then she'll show up and say something funny. She's got a name that no one knows and except a select <laughs> few people. So my mom shows up. It's pretty funny. And uh, yeah, she knows the podcast is strictly off limits. Like she's, <laughs> she's that's not good. allowed to watch that's, the podcast. That's, that's I don't like yeah. that. I bet she watches <laughs> it. She's, she's, my if you told don't her even that, know the podcast no exists, bro. I don't even. I've never even like brought it up. <laughs> I had oh, yeah. I had my mom tell me one time. She was like, "Oh yeah, something something like the that based podcast." And I was like, "I did not know you knew that that was real. You need to not you know, watch that." You know what you think of is like the meme at the dinner table, all the family looking at you. And you're like, "Honey, tell us about the base after dark podcast." <laughs> that would be. <laughs> It'll be a fucking nightmare. <laughs> My dad has listened to the podcast, and uh, his review was, uh, "You guys have no fucking clue," is what he said. I was just, I was just, <laughs> <laughs> I was just no clue. We don't. Oh, we yeah. don't. He made, that. He made that the is old kind man of the whole point, like though. the experience. Oh, wow. Like, you guys are stupid. You have no fucking clue. Like that was kind Ooh, of his. He's right. Yeah, that's kind of. Funny, I mean, actually. he is kind of right. He's kind of valid, yeah. but damn, he listened at least. Wrong. Yeah, thanks. Thank you. I was gonna say his first <laughs> name, but I probably shouldn't do that. Thanks, Dad. I didn't, get th I didn't get fucked up with Thanksgiving, but that was my first, I talked about it in the last podcast, my first Thanksgiving in almost six years. So that was, it was weird. I was a bit anxious. I had like trouble sleeping the night before, but uh, it went well. Um, ate a lot of food. And then I took like a fucking interdimensional nap on the couch. It was like in and out for three hours. <laughs> oh yeah. It was, uh, what did you mean good. by that? Like you've been working every other Thanksgiving? Yeah. My prior job, I always worked on Thanksgiving. I did some Christmases, but I never did Thanksgiving. So huh. That was the first one I've done in a long time. So it was pretty cool. It was nice. Very wholesome. Yeah. Good for you, man. A good holiday. Mm hmm You guys uh you guys got any racist uncles Thanksgiving? Uh it no. I not me. quite, no. <laughs> I know, no. definitely would, but not yeah. on the not on the side. I wanted my dad's side. I was with Thanksgiving for them. No, nothing there. But the Appalachian side, that's from like Virginia. 100 percent. Mm. but there's a lot of turmoil family drama going on right now so mm. there was no thanksgiving gatherings this year there, there Wait, were so everybody's you, up oh, in arms really? yeah your we got dad's a lot going side on. is appalachian no, no my mom the, just my mom's side your mom's side okay so yeah, you're she technically has, an, she has well, six an brothers and five American? sisters is that six, correct six, <laughs> six brothers five appalachian <laughs> six brothers you're appalachian American. you can't she call has, him that that's, she has six brothers. <laughs> that's our word say that, bro. <laughs> hey, there's a lot she has uh she has six brothers and uh five sisters so and then the whole extended behind that that's a lot of fucking people okay it's if it's six it? brothers and five sisters and they're appalachian did any of them fuck 
I don't know. Listen, I'm, you think you Dude. think I'm gonna ask her that? Dude, don't my tell sweet, me I don't know. Say my no, sweet man. mother, Say Big Zero. No. If I'm gonna ask her, if do you know if any of your siblings were fucking? I don't want to ask. God. You know what? I don't want to know the answer. Saying, I don't, don't want to know, know the answer either. Because you might say one for saying he don't know. I might. I might find out about some family drama I don't want to know about. Do you think it's a possibility? Do you, like statistically you think it's there's a chance that's what i'm saying statistically there definitely yeah. is a chance like somebody oh, fucking man. fooled around somewhere in the gene pool and i, I don't want to know that oh, it's, it's thanksgiving you know it's time for dessert someone you know <laughs> they, they bring the pies out there's a there's a cream covered pie and then you see your one aunt and one uncle like look at each other and like wink oh, a little bit no. then, oh, oh hell no well <laughs> dude I'm, no, I'm, T -Papa. Glad you last week. I'm glad you weren't here bro honestly <laughs> wasn't there an know. early episode where t papa he was just like dude you guys have hot cousins right like everybody's got a hot cousin. <laughs> was that T. Boppa that said that? I'm pretty well, sure no, that was. I think dude. that, that is always. Uh, dude. Have any of you ever, like, quote unquote, have you, any of you ever kissed your cousin? No. 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 Yeah, me either, man. We're not, either. We're not from know. Appalachia, <laughs> brother. We, we live a different life. What kind of question is that? Why I, go across the city well, when you can you go across that, the hall, dude? Yeah. Well, my cousins are more in like Ignoble's age range anyway, so it's, you know. Oh, my God. God. My, my Speaking slice. of which, where is he? That's been my topic. I was like, it's like he had that terrible performance and now he's got stage fright. He hasn't been here in two weeks. But <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. The, he's I'm got just, performance <laughs> anxiety. That's yeah. that terrible fantasy he game was, he had. Uh, he, Ignoble was actually in my city this last weekend. Did you see Did him? Did you see him? I didn't, dude. We had fantasy, <laughs> but it just didn't... Uh, it, it, it just didn't work out, man. I was actually really upset. I wanted to see him really badly, man, but... I don't know, man. I was so busy, and I was, like, also just, like, so on the go. I was in go-go mode, you know, as they say. And, like, I was, like, just constantly moving <sighs> from place to place. You wanted I was to see him but not Krylax. That's fucked up. Dude, I wanted to see Krylax, man. That mm. was I was even in more go-go mode there. Bro, that mm. was the 30th birthday party. He had stuff to do. Like yeah. Sammy's, 30th. Sammy's, Sammy's 30th. 30th. Sammy's 30th. Sammy's 30th. Yeah, Sammy's 30th. Can't miss Sammy's 30th. It was, it was Olive's 30th yesterday, dude. We had a good little time. What, really? Oh, yeah, shout out to Olive. Fuck. Wow. Did he did he get any yeah. did he did he have an olive experience or was he was he tamed? No, no, it was it was a fairly tame day. We went and we got a tattoo, his tattoo, his first tattoo dude, ever. Dude, olive looks so young. Really? Dude, good. Yeah. Yeah, he doesn't look he doesn't look thirty. Really? But like, <laughs> well, am, I mean, I guess part of it is. Like, <laughs> I don't mean like that, dude. I, I guess. No, 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 I just. Damn, what do you mean by that, Tasty? <laughs> Bro, fuck. He's my friend, dude. Okay, come on. I don't. I, I guess part of it is like the uh, the his demeanor. Like he just seems so positive. He's I baby think, girl. I think that at, like subtracts yeah. like three or four years if you're just no, you're I don't right. Know, generally positive. He's very about youthful, life. but like there's not a lot of he's like there's not a lot of like surface area for the energy to disperse so it makes sense like he's yeah, very so compact he's like a little you know? little rock yeah like he's Not sex he's sex swing area. material he's yeah sex that's why i bought he's him a, little, a sex uh, swing. Uh, I, it was his last birthday i think i bought him a sex swing i believe it was his what, last yeah, birthday. yeah 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 that was his How last birthday something like that cost it was actually like fifty dollars. It was That's... sturdy. Tasty was able to. He was held fine in it. You got to know. Yeah, yeah. I don't yeah, remember the pictures actually. Frame. Now that you're talking about it, wait. Yeah, it was uh, a solid sex wing. That's not very expensive. I would have thought they would have like been. It was all nylon. Are you, are I think. you interested? You know, it would definitely hold you for sure. <laughs> like if you got one you ain't using. Perhaps. No, I'm using I'm using my okay, buddy. Sorry. Well, this <laughs> sounds like a segue into an Adam and Eve sponsor. Actually, you know, funny story about <laughs> Ooh, that. Oh, I would take one. I, I would no, too. Hey, taking a break by from the our way, podcast I, to give you. I don't know if this is like not kosher or not, but I like I took an Adam and Eve sponsorship last year. So we're talking like eight months ago or something at this point. My code still works. You can use code nine rain. <laughs> and, and it's and it's fifty. I'm going to Adam and Eve. I know, seriously, fifty percent okay. off. Okay. And free shipping, like holy That's shit, crazy. kind of discount. Like huge you're working discount. right now, bro. You're actually working right now. Bro, this is crazy. Realistic, I <laughs> vibrating. Like four or five times. Huge. They working. don't even have to pay us, but if they sent us all like a sex toy for us individually, and we got to like review it on the podcast, how fun would that be? If we got to review <laughs> oh our sex toy. Oh my god, it'd be a great time. Are we all gonna, yeah, you know, okay. we're all gonna fuck something and review it? That'd <laughs> if be you guys sick. had to pick a dildo, would you do? <laughs> Realistic, vibrating, or huge? Those are the top three categories of dildo. <laughs> um, <laughs> what's number one? Wait, what's I number think. one? Is it vibrating? Is number one? Realistic. Realistic, realistic is number one. Is number wow. one. Vibrating okay. is number two, and huge is. Oh my god, those are huge, dude! Wow. <laughs> oh, oh definitely not this one huge. is called Mr. Marcus's Nine Incher. 
fuck. That's so scary. Who's Mr. Marcus? Mr. Marcus, man. Oh, he's black. That's all I know, dude. Yeah, he's Mr. fucking Marcus. Jesus That's Christ. That's like calling it Dr. Demetrius. Like, I think we know enough uh, about uh, it. So, I have a good story <laughs> about, I think maybe I've told him before on here. There's one I was in college, and me and St. Tits and the boys, we used to like, we used to pull up to Intimate Treasures because there was like one right down the road. From Intimate the college, treasures? yeah, it's a it's a sex store, and we'd show up and they have this fucking dildo that's encased, just in this huge case. It's got spotlights shining down on it. It's called the Great American Challenge. <laughs> I've oh, seen the Great I American think, Challenge. About that. I am googling this. I've seen that. that. You no. say something about that. I've before. seen that. The Great yeah. American Challenge. What kind of fucking <laughs> beast do you have to be to go? Buy this. Thing, you have well, to be this a, this one. You have to be a, a freak. Fifteen and a half inches. <laughs> Jesus yeah. Christ! You have, be, dude. you have to be a freak or super gay. There's no in between. There's no in between oh on that. I mean, you you goodness, have to be dude. one of the two. You have to be. You want you want your literal prostate like you want it to disappear after you're done with that thing, probably. Like mm. it's gonna be gone. Well, the, this one's called the American Bombshell War Daddy Dildo, which is a fucking <laughs> name, dude. <laughs> what that a sounded name. good, rolling off, hey, oh, roll off the tongue, hey, though. That was nice. Make, can they make the character count for our sense longer? Because, like... <laughs> yeah, American <laughs> Bombshell <laughs> War <laughs> Daddy <laughs> Dildo. Oh, There's some my good God. names out there that just Are you posting fit, some photos dude. of these in here? Oh, my God, bro. Yeah, dude, look at that <laughs> thing. So thick. That's kind of heavy. Dude, dude. Yeah, dude, that why? is... That oh is my groovy, God. bro. That's a Rasputin <laughs> dick right there, it's bro. $70. It's $70. Not with code <laughs> 9, Rain. It's 35 baby. <laughs> yeah, 35 and free shipping, bro. That's oh. over 10000 sold. Holy <laughs> fuck, bro. Who's fucking these wow. things, bro? I bet half of those were dudes bro, sending them that are buddies. That looks like an attachment for an AR-15. Holy <laughs> shit, bro. That's insane. You guys All read American the of Whopper. Toys? No, but time. I'm about to. That sounds God. awesome. They're just so good, honestly. Uh, Let me uh, find a good one. Okay, yeah. Can yeah, you yeah, find yeah. one for us? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I'll put something in my okay, butt, but I'm not one... putting that in my butt. <laughs> this review is from, from a, a, a customer named Big Red Rocket Rider. And they said, <laughs> This thing is hefty, big, girthy, and an exhilarating <laughs> ride. Not big for a beginner. Girthy. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. I like this the, one's from, like, this one's from Shauna. End. Yeah. <clears throat> Shauna says, Pros. Nicely Ooh. veined, surprisingly large and wide. Material is soft, but not too soft. The head is thinner than the rest, which makes it easier to work up to the full girth. Cons. I wish a woman would tell me that. Smell. Oh no! Oh, I remember oh, that part. No, but me too, bro. Me hey, too. I get it. <laughs> I, I, she. I hope she means out of the box. So like. <laughs> not, she like takes it out of her and she's not, like, "This thing smells so really weird." Like, <laughs> mine smells wow. so fishy. You're like, hey, I don't. <laughs> oh my oh. god, that would be a funny bit. Like trying to find. Like reading reviews and then having people try and guess what they're for. Oh, <laughs> that'd be kind of funny. Or like like sex toy reviews that could also be good reviews for podcasts. Okay. Wait, let me stop you real quick. <laughs> Scientist just posted. Scientist just posted a photo of the oh creature. <laughs> Oh no, we can't show oh this. Oh my god. <laughs> the creature, you can read the creature, it. <laughs> the creature Cox Hydra Sea Monster dildo. That's the one I would want. Like, if I was buying a dildo, I would want dude. the creature Cox Hydra Sea Monster dildo. <laughs> that looks like one of the guns from Halo 2. <laughs> <laughs> And how cool is it you can safely put it in your ass? Like, that's just sick. Oh, my God. It looks like a gun. I want to see what too. they have. Like, what, what's the men's? What's the men's section looking like here for men? Oh, that's what that I'm, is the men's uh, section. Wait, yeah. what please, do you I don't mean, want that. Bro. I don't want that. That's too much. Uh, oh, we I have like prostate toys? Creature cocks. Penis, like, wait. penis sleeves, and extensions. This is where this is where we get it. Wait, wait what? Hold wait. Up. Okay, can I read no, something? <laughs> this is not yeah, what we yeah. want. I need, I need to read something real quick because I, I need some, some greater information. Um, anyway, this is the Dilio Platinum Secret Explore dildo, and the description says, um, The enlarged tip and curved shaft are the perfect shape for finding and teasing some of the most sensitive and elusive zones, including G-spot, P-spot, and a spot. I didn't know there were other spots. What's an a spot? There are other spots. What's a p what's a p spot? Is p the I'm prostate? I'm assuming that's prostate, right? Oh, uh, what's the g what's I, the a spot? I don't know. The a spot is the anterior fornix erogenous zone. Uh, it's an area oh. located between the front vaginal wall and the cervix. 
I don't have either of those. Oh, so you need some dirt. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to need a map. Well, I'm not buying this one. Never mind. <laughs> oh, You're going to need some I mean, girth to know. hit that, probably. You're going to have to put something crazy oh, in there. Shit, that makes sense. I'm looking at the penis oh, pumps right now. There's like, you know, you got the, you got like the blue collar penis pump and then you got, you got the tasty penis pump. That's what I'm seeing here. We got, we, <laughs> the we can, tasty penis pump. <laughs> What's that mean? That means that it does it for you. That means you don't have to do anything. Oh, okay. It just auto pumps. Oh, well, I'm over here, mean. I'm over here squeezing my fucking thing. Like I saved He's $20. Got, yeah, Fuck like, this guy. Like the blood pressure fucking arm. Like, the more, the more AFK one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Uh, Holy fuck, That's... yeah. Wow. wow yeah, I, I clicked on penis sl sleeves and extensions. This is to make your dick bigger, with, but not making it bigger. With a, You're putting a fake dick onto your own dick. That just feels demoralizing, I feel like. I don't know about that. But... Ooh, the Hummer 2.0 Ultimate Blowjob Machine is only $400. <laughs> Wait, where is that the at? I want to see the link like that. Hummer brand? Write that the, down. The Hummer 2.0. Is well, it actually it's not Hummer? The, oh, it's not Hummer the car manufacturer. Like Hummer? Yeah. But I Hummer is like, like a blowjob, I okay, think. Okay, I thought I thought it like was related wow. to the brand Hummer, and I was like, "There's no way they came out." Did with you one. link it? Link yeah, it I just after pictured dark. like, yeah, I got you, what if I you got had you. like a monster truck and like a pocket pussy <laughs> crossover? You know, like <laughs> you're like rev, <laughs> like you have to like rev it up oh to put God. it on, and you're like, <laughs> and then it's just going you're, hard. You're, you're you're in the driver's Dude. seat, and it just kind of like comes out the bottom of the <laughs> Look, steering wheel for those long drives. Look at the After Dark. That is the Adam and Eve banging Betty. I just feel like, yeah, I would probably fuck that. But after I'm done, dude, the feeling I would have, the feeling I would oh, have would be, would be, bro, would I would be feel tough, like a bro. fucking loser carrying that thing to the sink <laughs> and like trying to clean it up, dude. <laughs> like stretching it out. No, no, dude. Well, the, the I don't know. I mean, feel like a loser is just to not clean it. You know what? You're not that much of a loser because oh, it says God. right there over a hundred thousand sold. A hundred thousand men to put their cock in one Dude, of those. At I least. was just looking. I was looking at some of these sold numbers. The, we have to be inflating these, right? Like who's who's For fact sure. checking them? Right? <laughs> well, no, that's not an inflatable one. That's a silicon one. <laughs> Shut up, bro. <laughs> you know. Uh, nice, nice. All right. Well, nice. uh, you know, Christmas is coming up, so you know, if you need like. A Dude, I know what I'm getting for Secret you, Santa, bro. Use, use <laughs> I, I, just, yeah, right everybody now, buy right. each other sex toys it'd be great bro, i swear like if the, they're gonna contact me for january and be like hey nine rain i know it's been a while but your link's <laughs> popping off bro yeah your code was used 47 <laughs> times like, <what? laughs> Somebody, we've sold we've we've moved 10 creature yeah. cock hydra yeah, seacocks this is insane I, there's gotta be 10 people listening that think that that's a good enough joke gift to use code nine rain like i would really ha -ha, if, joke gift ha ha right guys uh -huh. i am yeah. fucked up though because you think about that well you know you have that one family member who's pretty innocent imagine they wrap they unwrap the hydrocock sea monster probably just <laughs> <That's> <laughs> to me that's hilarious what is this? i don't know <laughs> like, uh, that'd be good it would be great that'd be good but damn holy anybody else have ben a good thanksgiving ball. holy fuck <laughs> yeah. sorry jesus yeah, that was quite okay. a thing um oh man I had a good Thanksgiving. <laughs> Mine was very chill. Um, I, I have a twin, a sister, and a brother, but they were all at what well, my brother, older brother, was there, um, and then my twin was there. But then their <clears throat> families weren't. So, it, long story short, small uh, Thanksgiving, which was kind of nice. I've never had a small Thanksgiving. Especially well, I do have a question for you. So yeah. you posted you posted your food at 12 p.m. <laughs> yeah. my time. Yeah. You guys eat at 12? <laughs> Holy! I wasn't fuck. even awake yet. We bro. always do a big lunch. <laughs> My, I don't, my family's always oh. done a big lunch. And part of that is, now that I'm thinking about it, it's because <coughs> my family, uh, my dad's side of the family all hunts. And so we would always, like, when I was little especially, we'd do a Thanksgiving lunch, and then, like, a lot of the family would go out hunting in the evening. So I think that's probably why we do Thanksgiving lunch instead of dinner. But then you can also just, everybody just eats leftovers um, I was gonna ask you eat the same thing again later or yeah, we just eat the same thing later yeah. Okay, and I ate it for like two more days too. I took a bunch of ziplock bags home I I actually reheated it in uh, my cast iron skillet uh, Which I've never done before usually you just like microwave it, but I was like, ah, oh, this would be kind of fun It was good. I got oh, the most oh pathetically God. small piece of turkey and the most large helping of ham and stuffing. I just said, fuck that turkey. I got a piece out of respect, you know, like I got a, like a <laughs> well, decent piece. The turkey piece. isn't always the worst. It's yeah, the worst. yeah. We, we were talking the about this last the, week, the but goat, the dark really. meat, the dark meat on the turkey is real. <clears throat> I, 
I will go for that stuff. So but, I was gonna say my cousin, she brought there was actually I know we said we're eating the same shit, but the stuffing put Italian sausage in there and it was actually it slapped. Ooh, it that actually, sounds yeah. good. That really I, good. Yeah. Spice. That threw me that really? threw me back a little bit, but yeah, I was a fan. That's pretty nice. Dang. Got Appalachian out. side or which side are we talking? No, no, no. I did, listen, I'm not seeing them this year, bro. There's a lot going on out there, you know. I, it's it's not good right now. Bro, I, I, st I still think about that meal that we had at that like breakfast place in Gatlinburg. Oh, that's that's Crockett's? gotta be the yeah. That's still gotta be some of the best food I've had for dollar bro. amount. Like uh, it was unreal. Yeah. I have had three people in the last like I don't know. I want to say probably two months come into my stream and ask for that breakfast place that we ate at in Gatlinburg <laughs> because we talked about it so much and I have pulled up Crockett's and then gave them a link while I was live dude like I need yeah. a, I need like a code T Papa when I'm when I'm passing dude, out this. Like, is, is it I was a cool. chain? are they anywhere else no 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 it's just there no, I was no, like I was there. cool yeah, yeah. <clears throat> I was cool with the whiskey place I was alright but like literally I should just took us to like four, there's like four or five other places like that there if we just <laughs> we should have did that every meal because there's like a dinner I, versions of that like there's a place called the farmer's daughter and they like bring it out to you like old school style like one like sir it's it's like a michelin star but it's fucking twenty dollars and you get fucking an Dude, insane amount of food i, I just it's like it each like course good, we just bro. keep yeah yeah it's, yeah that's yeah. what i should have done but i yeah, tell a lot of people about that meal <laughs> uh. yeah my uh mm. my i didn't have anything like too crazy happen this weekend i just uh i had a good time though you know wednesday night before thanksgiving i texted my ex-girlfriend Oh. Asked her, are you going to be in town nice. this weekend? Are you going to be free? <laughs> and she texted me back and said, hey, yeah, I'm coming back tomorrow. I'll be free this time, this time, and this time. And then I just <clears> typed <throat> back a couple letters, but I never actually sent it so that she sees in the iMessage the little dots that I'm typing. Oh. And I just enjoyed my weekend. Bro, what the Damn. hell? That's Holy good. Fuck. Fuck. Wait, this Christ, wasn't the bro. lesbian from Denver, right? Actually, it was. Oh man! That's fucked. Damn. Was. I don't know good. any what of the happened? context, did you, but this did is you, pretty great. Did you just like <laughs> you were thinking about it, beat your shit, and then decided, nah? Like, did you have clarity, or did you? Did no, you just, no, you no, just no. Honest, no, I, 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 no. I just like fuck it, dude. I'm just gonna do this. I, I kind of forgot after a bit, and then I was like, I'm just gonna keep this going. Why not? I was like, did oh, she I double message you? Did she double message you at all and be like, yo? She did not. No, she not did okay. not. No. Nah. <clears throat> she that was to. never the. That was never the. the <clears throat> what if she did though? Would you have? Would you have followed through? Oh, 100%. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. What yeah. game are we even playing here? Yeah, at this he point, feels dude. like you <laughs> know, No, no, you won at that point. So, yeah, you can message her back. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, what, sure, what, are, definitely. what are we fighting for, you know? Like, mm -hmm. <laughs> we all have the same goal here. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. Yeah. A little um, bit of uh, manipulation. <laughs> it's just my a light manip, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, just a bit. My Thanksgiving yeah. was actually kind of cute because it was my first married Thanksgiving. You know, oh, it's like when babies yeah. have their first Christmas and you make like little ornaments. Um, it's really sweet. It was really good. My uncle convinced Loppy that we have a family tradition where whoever is new to thanksgiving that year has to take do you guys know the mezcal with a scorpion on the bottom yes mm. yeah. yeah well he convinced we did the him worm the worm Michigan. yeah really he convinced him yeah. that whoever's new to thanksgiving has to eat the scorpion at the bottom of the oh, bottle God. which is just not true that's just Wait, not a, a thing a scorpion <laughs> yeah. They yeah scorpions in mezcal yeah. too there's a one yeah yeah, yeah. 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 oh god yeah they do all kinds so, of stuff uh, i have i ate the scorpion in college what really, really? I'm gonna tell you, tell them we're tell them we're fellow the scorpion eaters. Wow, I yeah, thought so no one ate it and that. it got stuck in his esophagus. Oh. <laughs> and then afterwards, my shit. uncle was like, "I'm so glad you did this. Like we've never been able to get someone to to make this a tradition, and now we started one." <laughs> Honestly, yeah. knowing Neil, like him dying Ew. by eating a scorpion just sounds right. Like if he would have died, yeah. like we'd be like, you know, <laughs> it is what it way. is. Yeah. It is what it That's is. That's the way. <clears throat> hey, he didn't crunch it. He just tried and swallow it whole. Yeah, no, he they put in a shot for him. Everyone was like uh, like cheering him on, you know, they were like chanting. It was pretty cute. Are that's, so how, big, that's what how big, that's what yeah. I remember too, but I couldn't see anything because I was so fucking drunk and I just remember cr I was crunching it on purpose and everybody's just like, Yeah, and I'm just it was like this big. Yeah. Oh, scorpions that's are so like pretty, sharp pretty and yeah. pointy. It was a cr I, like I do remember I was completely trash when I did it, but it was a decent little crunch. Like I, I was definitely there. Like, I, yeah, oh. he didn't bite it. He just swallowed that shit. Yeah, that's, uh, that's, that's even crazier to me. That's yeah. terrifying. 
<laughs> mm. Oh, well, Damn. speaking of disgusting food, I did have a little bit I wanted to do today. I actually, I bought something on Amazon yesterday. <clears throat> and, okay. Uh, look, at th- look at this. It's an Australian snack box, which has Coca-Cola. like a bunch of cute little stuff. But there's one specific reason that I bought it. If I can fucking open it. Okay. Vegemite. Ew. Have you guys have you guys ever had no. Vegemite? Yeah, yeah. No. I, have I, want, I have not, and I've heard it's horrific, so I want to taste it right now. Like. You're gonna try it right now? Well, yeah, I was I was gonna maybe make some like toast or something. Yeah, put it, it on put a piece of No, just try it. You well, just yeah, I feel like you should like... just try it. Everyone tells me not to do that Finger. explicitly. Finger. Just, yeah, just, you're right. Do some toast. Go throw a piece of bread in. We'll, we'll, we can wait for this. I, well, this I don't good. even have toast in my house. I'm going to fucking California liberal. I'm just going to keep bread in my house like that. <laughs> what? No, nah, that's a good point. Yeah. So what are you going to put like it on? Like a cracker or something? You have like you... a saltine or something? Yeah, you got a cracker? You surely got, got a saltine. cracker Dude, there. This, for sure. this is fucking disgusting looking. Yeah. This can't... is like... Oh, I didn't know if you guys could like see that. It's like yeah. a sludge, dude. Look at that. Oh, <laughs> that looks my, like your coffee machine when it's broke. My vision. Yeah. I, I had an Australian roommate, and he always had this stuff, and his was like a little more gritty and black. Oh, and does it like, stink? Wait, bro, okay, bro, I guess bro. it does. <laughs> <laughs> it can't be that bad, dude. You you walk. I just you took cannot, way too big of a whip. You can't, dude, it's, it's not strong, that bad, but it was. But, it was but, strong. But, but, okay, do you have a go get a cracker? Get a cracker. <laughs> I love the sound you. You made. can't what be wearing that, that shirt and not have crackers oh, yeah. in your house, bro. I know you right, got some crackers. Gonna, uh, get a oh, Ritz. Yeah, get a Ritz cracker. Treat yourself if you got it. You know what I mean? No, no, no. I do. I do. Hold up. <laughs> yeah. Club cracker. Yeah, you're gonna want something buttery with that. Crazy. That's good. That's, that's a good. One. While we wait, what is everybody's favorite? What is everybody's favorite package cracker? Like, you know, there's a lot of Club choices cracker. out there. My favorite package like, cracker. Period. Yeah. I have been alive for 27 years, and no one has asked me this question. <laughs> yeah, I'm caught off guard right now. Honestly, it's a, it's a good question. There's a lot of variety. Like, you know, I, I, if you think I, about honestly, it. Honestly, I like what Tasty got. I like the Ritz. Like, Ritz goes crazy. Ritz. It's, it's, Ritz. I, I, love some Ritz. I just yeah. dude, my, my room literally one. smells like fucking Vegemite right now. It's like I walked it smells in, like I the like, last Whoa. time that girl came over, bro. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, no, dude. No, hey, hey. Look, did I tell you about that? Yeah, that's on the last that. Patreon, by the way. You want to hear that story? <laughs> uh, make sure you subscribe. Also, Nine Rain has a juicy story today. He's going to be telling on oh, the Patreon yeah. cast that is apparently pretty after dark, which is dude, honestly he leaked a little bit of it, I'm and I'm just like, for damn, Nine, Nine Rain. Rain. After dark. That's what I'm, I'm surprised that you have it. Like you've never had one, so like I'm I'm, I'm actually very interested. So. Yeah, it's a, it was a lot of fun. It was actually a great experience. Oh my god, dude, hold up. Look at look at this thing, dude. Let her, let her. <laughs> I'm going to call, call her. Look at that. Uh, <laughs> oh, god. oh my god. I had the score bottle got a rosebud, bro. I'm about to turn my camera off. Jesus dude, Christ. This thing's farting right now. I wonder if Amaranth <laughs> would make Vegemite. That'd be kind of sick, right? Wait, wait, what? let's show how much you put on there. What is that? No, it's it's like a pee, dude. You're supposed to do a <laughs> tiny, tiny oh, amount. Yeah, no, that's like are, normal. You are not supposed to put a huge. It's amount not like ketchup. All right, go ahead. <laughs> All right. Um. Also, uh, dude, I was supposed to try this for the first time live on stream, so I'm gonna lie. Just lie. And say yeah. It's my, lie. I'm, no, I'm gonna lie. Oh it's yeah. Okay. Say it's my first time on stream. So just yeah. so you guys. You're a good actor. Don't, you don't got this. Bit. <clears throat> good luck. You? He's gonna like it, bro. Oh wait. Yeah. <laughs> It's not terrible. Okay. It's really not it's that not bad. It's not terrible. It's just like fermented yeast, right? I'm going to put a little more on, actually. I don't. I uh, think I need a little more. Okay. It's, right. it's a thick, dark brown Australian food spread made from leftover brewer's yeast extract with various vegetable and spice additives. Oh, that's way too much. Is this so, too much? No, nah, I just let that rip, man. No. All right. Yeah. Okay, oh, bro, you, you ate the worm. You were made for this. You've eaten the worm. That's you can true. eat this. I'm okay. to, I just want to like spread it a little bit so it's not just one. He has ate the worm. Blob. Can confirm. Yeah, that looks correct. Okay. Good luck. Oh. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, 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 no. Turns out he just likes Ritz crackers. So. Uh, <laughs> no. No. What did it? What did nope. you like about it? What does it taste uh, like? It's kind of sour. Oh, it's very sour. Yeah, it's like. But, it, dude, legit. Like this, I don't know if it's kind of fucked up to say, but it, it tastes like bad pussy, like a little, like a little bit. <laughs> I mean, it's fermented yeast, so it kind of makes. Hey, it man, nice. listen, dude. There's no such thing. 
there's, your there's guy. no such thing as bad. You got you got average pussy. You got good pussy, dude. There's no such thing as bad pussy. Ham tastes like a girl's girl. You love to see. I hope this doesn't taste like average pussy, dude. I don't. Know. Yeah, it's really like, do. dude, it's like stuck in my mouth. Actually, it fuck, it does not taste good. It's kind of, dude, it's like a like a hey, rotten bro. taste in my mouth. You need to get some Lacroix. Mm. You need to wipe drink all the yeah. water. <laughs> Damn, that's just Camp Counselor water bottle right there. <clears throat> Jason, do you know what well, you're That'll, that'll you be a good YouTube short, though. Mark that down. My first one, I'm like, oh, this is good. Yeah, I know. <laughs> like, this is fucking bad. Well, I mean, we need, to let the, we need to let the American public know that it's, yeah, it's fucking terrible. Yeah. You got you to put it all the Look at all the other snacks I got in here. There's like a bunch of Holy. chocolates and stuff. So I'm going to eat these so I can get the fucking thing. It's actually, it's like getting worse, actually, in my mouth. Did uh, you, did someone send you that or did you order that? I ordered it. Because I was going to buy Vegemite to try on stream, but then I saw like this whole snack box, and I was like, I'm going to try it. That's way more fun. No. Mm. Yeah, there'll be a lot more in there for you. <clears throat> oh. Whew. You're so brave. I'm so proud of you. It was unpleasant. I was, I was asking why brave, you were I'm gone. I was asking everybody what their favorite like package cracker is. Like, if you got a go-to. <laughs> like, what's the go-to? A package cracker? Yeah, like, if you if the Peter's cracker... Like, if, you, if you're building the charcuterie board... Like what crackers are you throwing on there? Okay, but package cracker a, a, for the charcuterie a board. Those are two cracker. different things, kind of. For a charcuterie board, I do like a rosemary cracker. The rosemary With triscuits. Like, yeah, those are bomb. I've never That's... had the triscuits, but like a like Ooh, a, those are really like good. a ritz rosemary like a ritzy kind of rosemary so tart. Hard. Yeah, y'all get it. Mm. I like I, I like like a dark baked thin uh, sesame cracker. Mm. Oh wow. That's nice. That's kind of intimate. Ooh, that is pretty good. Yeah. yeah. I honestly like just the I feel like that's your taste in women, too. Amanda Ooh, yeah. Real. Yeah, what you mean by Dark, that? baked, thin, sesame cracker? <laughs> <laughs> kind of your wife, honestly. Damn. Yeah. I turned T-Papa's really wife is. against him recently, actually. What that's happened? A... <clears throat> well, uh, me and T-Papa filmed the video uh, recently together. And uh, I did get his wife to attempt to attack him during that video while we were. She's mid top. Mm. She just comes in and starts hitting me with a pillow, bro, as hard as she can. And she like, doesn't stop, dude. She doesn't stop oh, until like, I physically shove her. Like I have to. <laughs> like, what you shoved like... your wife. Oh yeah, Dang. full force, left hand. You're not and the first time. Is, you know what would have been the best bit is if after you shoved her, I called the police and they came there and you told them that you went to jail for domestic violence. That would have been a good video. <laughs> that would have been a really good joke. Yeah, that would have been that's a great really video. funny. Yeah. And then you have to sit there for 12 hilarious. hours before you get out and then you can't be in the same house after. It would have been hilarious. It would have been so good. That would have been pretty funny. Thank you, but that hey, didn't man, happen. Don't, it's not domestic violence if the cops don't get called, baby. <laughs> <laughs> that's actually very true unfortunately that's, that's what yeah, they yeah. say yeah that is what they say <laughs> I mean, yeah that is just violence <laughs> yeah <laughs> definitely yeah. <laughs> what, a, what a wild arc we've taken yeah <laughs> Well, uh, Thanksgiving really does anybody have anything like else that. to share about Thanksgiving, or I'm gonna ask this <laughs> next topic? I don't have I don't have anything to share about Thanksgiving, but this, this weekend, okay, uh, upcoming, I leave on what's today? Today is Wednesday. On Friday, uh, and for the weekend, I go and hang out with uh, Annie's family, and dude, there Ooh. is family drama, dude. And oh man, did so I'm I'm pulling up to like poke the bear a little bit, and uh, went to the dispo today, and for the very Mormon family, I bought uh edible gummies for like the nice 80 year old grandma and she's gonna open on christmas morning so i got her some edibles it's gonna well actually we're gonna open presents there so that's gonna are be you exciting. gonna tell let me ask, let me ask, ask you are question. they gonna so, be happy about that oh i think she will be but i think everyone else will be mad yes it's going to be uh well let me ask you about that so you if you have family drama you can just pull up and, and fuck with it nothing bad will happen Cause like if yeah, I do that, no. if I do that, Uncle Mark shoots Uncle Joe, you know. So it's like it's a different, it's like a different dynamic. Wow. Like it could go, yeah. it could go really bad if I try that. <laughs> I'd love to lighten the mood because it's not, it's not good right now. We got some shit going on. It's a lot of, yeah. a lot of dispute. There's, lot of there's, dispute no one's gonna tensions. get murdered. It's gonna be <laughs> okay. funny though. But like yeah, so I bought, I bought weed for the grandma. That's kind of did nice it, of did do. Annie greenlight this project or yes or is this Annie just has a greenlit the project yes okay, okay. yes and it's good as long as she's done it yeah yeah she's backed the Kickstarter Annie, and everything. A Annie Annie's trying to get back at her family a little bit so she's like she's like how do we poke the bear and she's like okay let's go buy Grandma mm. weed you know? <laughs> <laughs> I don't do it. it's harmless you know? oh, I definitely do it. yeah 
That's not bad. And pl plus, the grandma will probably like it anyway. So, like, that's objectively mm -hmm. a good gift. Well, you know? like, the thing is, the grandma had her hands on some, but it was in Utah. So, they were just going to a drug dealer and they, like, didn't do that anymore. So, I guess the grandma mm. hasn't had weed in, like, in a very long time. And, like, I'm next to the dispo. So, like, we just went to the dispo and got her some, like, actual, like, dispensary edibles. For oh, Christmas, holy you know? shit. She's gonna be <laughs> <a> fucked. <laughs> She's gonna be You're fucked. You're a good grandson in law. Like, that's dope. <laughs> yeah, bro. That's yeah. pretty sweet. I think yeah. I mean yeah when I get to when I get to that age like I'm I'm trying to do a lot of drugs honestly I think that's the move. Oh, oh this lady she's heavily addicted to opiates just like oh. nonstop oh. popping pills. Oh, okay. Well then the weed is good for her. Yeah the yeah. weed will be no, good. Yeah no yeah. yeah. But the thing you should give oh. her fentanyl. She might like it. <laughs> Okay. That's murder. That. So <laughs> <laughs> not enough to kill her, just enough to wait, wait, get wait, the edge off. Wait, oh let me, wait one sec. Oh it'll one kill sec. the pain all right. I mean, fentanyl is still used in, in, in hospitals and in medical Yeah, fentanyl is a real know? drug, you know? It's a real drug. Yeah, it let me show you. It's never meant to be abused, you guys. Well, this is, a uh... Well, no, that's all I was going to say. Like, I mean, yeah, maybe, but, um... Oh, wait. I already have this saved. Sorry. I was going to show you this image here. I'm going to put it... Mm. So, did you pull this up? This is good. Ed good educational, too, here, you know? For the, for the people me, out there. Is he going to show us a lethal dose of fentanyl? Is that I am, bro. Look at it. Look at that <laughs> I shit. Knew it, dude. That's, that's a I lethal knew dose. That's what he was going to do. A lethal dose. That's insane. <laughs> dude, I could fit way more in my fucking mouth, so I'd be fine. <laughs> bro, throw that that's up. That's it. That's it, bro. That'll kill you. You're dead. <laughs> you're my favorite part about looking at this is just okay, you're the not silicone dead, but you pussy could be right dead. before it. Okay. Oh, no. Right. Yeah, make sure that I, I think like strong. that would kill all of us, but Hamzy. That's fair to say. Yeah, right, I think. I've definitely had that in my system sure. at one point. I well, had, a dealer, put it up your who, ass. I had yeah. a dealer once who 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 yeah. someone mutual tested the shit and was like, "Yo, this is fentanyl." Like, <laughs> I've never had did, a ever, did anything you do it ever. Did you still do it? Why are you smiling no, like no, that? No, no, I never. I not, <laughs> nothing ever in my that I ever consumed. But why are you was like, speaking same, in codes? Yeah, why is it from yeah, the same so source? Person, you know, it was like from the same source, somebody tested the cop inside me wants to arrest you right now. Why are you talking like this, bro? No, no, no. no. Someone else tested the shit from the same person that I There's get my some shit from, speak, and they were like, bro. "Yo, there is." Uh, that, yeah, <laughs> he was like, "I just want to let you know, like, you pick up from the same guy, and we tested it, and <clears throat> got fentanyl." Someone who isn't me. It's like that. <laughs> was it me? Well, Did I mean, you do it? I never test my shit, so you know it wasn't me. <laughs> Dude, you cannot have a positive fentanyl test if you never test it. So, that's like, true. Exactly. Yeah, you can't that's have an true. STD if you don't get STD tested, right? So, that's, that's true, true too. Haven't you guys uh, faked a pee test, like faked a, a drug test in some way? Uh -uh. Yeah, yeah, I did. And I had to, well, I I to supervise one recently. A supervised a drug test? I'm not, didn't I can't your, say more. <clears throat> Devon, what? didn't your sister just fake a drug test? Whoa, well, I was gonna go into the story <laughs> Alleg about Allegedly. Someone Somebody. I know, a friend <laughs> of mine. <laughs> a friend of mine uh, used, um, like, this thing called Monkey Whiz is what the website you buy Monkey Whiz, and it's like, it's fake pee, and, uh... Yeah, I mean, I'm just waiting to hear back. Like, well, I guess everyone is waiting to hear back what happens, you know, with the fake pee. I just didn't know if she any of you guys have had ex It's called yeah, well, monkey she, piss? She, she passed the, like, the, the clinical portion of it. Like, like the smell test, the, like, the in-person. But it just fucking has to go smell the, it, dude? Yeah. No way. <laughs> dude, there's actually so much. And, like, um, there's, <laughs> there's the some fine animals. urine you have here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Rather crazy. high in nitrogen, it smells <laughs> like. <laughs> Have you been eating Noble, asparagus? Like, Noble, like, <laughs> Noble went to school all these years to actually do that. He's just lying yeah. to us, bro. He's the piss doctor. Dude. He He's got to be the piss doctor. Yeah, he's just sniffing pee, bro. <laughs> he's got a little cocktail stare. <laughs> just saying, mm, yes. No, like, Noble mm. just shows up at the doctor's office with a fucking lab coat and like takes the samples and just fucking gives them a little whiff, dude. <laughs> <laughs> it does usually work though. I mean, it's like the severity of like what you're getting tested for is like if it's really that bad, like they'll literally be staring at your dick. I, I think the yeah. list of things that Ignoble wouldn't like to smell is probably short. That's probably the true. short list. Yeah. 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 It's um, so interesting to me I that one of the like the longest half lives like for like <laughs> drug test is the fucking is marijuana like it's the yeah, most almost common. every drug test is like for weed pretty much yeah because like, yeah most stuff goes through your system in a day or two it's out like it's gone yeah, yeah. yeah. unless it's a hair um, test I feel like and why are we yeah. still testing ah, in 2023 dude shitty parents. 
nah, that that's the one that stays. But uh, I don't know. I had one that I was definitely not gonna pass, and I just like drank to the most <laughs> just told unbelievable them. amount. I'm not of gonna water. pass this. Diluted it. <laughs> mm. Yeah, Diluted. and and when they got my results back, they were like, "Your uh, your shit was just straight up water." Like, <laughs> like they're like, "This doesn't count." Like you can't do. Yeah, it's like inconclusive. Like they kind of knew. They yeah, they basically <coughs> called it inconclusive. That's what and that like, means. You yeah. have to come in and do another one, but that bought me enough time because they weren't to like get, you have to immediately. Uh, that's do what it. a lot they of people like, say. Yeah, you. Yeah, you... they're like it, they, it bought me enough time to go. That's smart. You know, hit the sauna, hit the dude. Yeah, hit you the know sauna, my dude. friend. Hit the track. My friend in high school, um, we he got caught smoking weed by the cops one time, and he was underage, so they put him on this thing called Task. I don't remember what it stands for. I think it's probably just like an Arizona thing, but they drug test you every like month, I think, for six months or something like that. So you can't smoke weed. It's like a, a league, like a state drug test, probably kind of serious. But what he did, he kept smoking weed the entire time. We smoked <laughs> weed like every single day. And did he try never, and stop him? He, no, he never failed because every day before the drug test, he would take a bottle of water and he would fill it with a jello packet. Like the full thing that you make jello out of, and he would chug that. And he said he read online that it would make you pass drug tests, and he passed every single drug test. Like he showed up to those things high. He pissed out jello water, and it worked. Wow. Interesting. But he was also Dude. six foot four and like 110 pounds, so he had no body fat to store like THC in because that's where it's stored. <laughs> it's like fat soluble. So, like, maybe that was part of it. But he did huh. drink jello water and pass drug tests. So, consider it. <clears throat> We did the, uh, me and Sanders, we did the Blue Mountain State oil change. I was no, just going to no bring up the way. oil change, dude. You did Absolutely. not do an no, oil change. No, we didn't do the oil change. We, we always talked about it. <laughs> no what is that? Way. Wait, I don't know what that is. You oh, you've you've never heard of an Blue oil Mountain change? State, first of all, uh -huh. you got to watch Blue Mountain State. That's, you know, that's a desperation yeah, move. That's, Banger that's, it's bad if you're doing an oil change, dude. Banger okay, TV show. Yeah, Seth, you explain it. I'll give you the, uh, I'll give you the definition here. Um... Let me see here. <clears throat> basically, um, he, you pretty much get a tube and sticks it. It's basically you're sounding yourself all the way down to your bladder to drain the dirty piss out. And then you're going to inject the, <laughs> the clean piss. piss. The clean well, you piss. You can just go pee. Yeah. And then you're going to go, you're going to inject the clean piss into your bladder. That way, when you pee, it'll be the pain, the clean piss is How coming out. How do you out. inject it? You reverse catheter, catheter clean pee. Catheter. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. So you pee all your normal pee out, put a catheter in, mm. and then let some. Okay. So like, here, here's clean something interesting. That, that monkey whiz uh, thing that I referenced, they yeah. have a version that like has a fake dick. So you like pull it out, <laughs> and you got a little. That's fake so dick. smart. That's actually good. And it though. looks yeah. like a real penis. I mean, honestly, it really doesn't. So the person's like. If, if the person's like standing a couple feet away, you could probably get away with this fake dick. But if they're like up in there, like it's going to look like a fake dick. Um, yeah. But yeah, you can pee out of a fake dick if you do have to pee in front of you someone. You could act that up though. That comes towards you. Hey man, get away from my cock! Or just like stop trying to touch me. Well, well that's what myself. that would make I, him real suspicious, bro. They'd be grabbing for your meat. I asked a lot of meat, questions. Dude. I asked a lot of questions about the monkey whiz, and uh, someone in my chat said that the only time they ever failed with monkey whiz is whenever they did a sniff check. And I'm like, dude, if I peed in a cup and the guy immediately sniffed it, I'd be like, bro, <laughs> I'd be like, pissed, you got to ask, man, before you do yeah, that. I'll be pissed. <laughs> like, that's not cool. That was fucking hilarious. They yeah, couldn't pay me enough to have that job, the piss sniffer did. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, on, on the same topic of the oil change, like TV show, uh, uh, you know, techniques. Uh, there was also the workaholics one, you know, where they knew they were going to fail and the mm. guy sneaks into the, he sneaks into the lab and he's just loaded up with everything in his system. He smokes a <laughs> bunch of weed, takes a bunch of pills and does everything before, sneaks into the lab, finds where they have all the piss samples and he just pisses into all of them. <laughs> yeah. So everyone tests his positive and they're like, oh, so something's good. wrong, you know, everyone, <laughs> there's no way everyone has it. <laughs> Dude, actually, yeah, that was a that was a heat show, by the way. That's a good that's idea. A heat show. That's, yeah, that's, much, that's much better than fucking sounding yourself with, with clean pits. That's I would probably. do that for one of you guys. <clears throat> oh, that's so you would nice pee in my drug yeah. test, or you'd sound yourself. Um, no, I'd pee in your drug test. Saying, I think that's my yeah. limit. Like, I would do a lot for you guys. I don't think I could do sounding for you guys. I think that's yeah, like, probably not. That'd be tough. 
It would have to be like do or die for you. Like if it's gonna save your career, like oh. I'd consider it. But it'd be it would be no. Tough. I'm not even talking career. It'd be like life. I'd yeah, be like get a new career. Die. Get a new career. Yeah, get a sure. new career, dude. Grow up. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, I'll save your career, man. Okay. Fuck you guys. All right. That's fine. I mean, I I, I'll, I jotted that down that you were down to save my career by saving yeah. yourself. I got you. Like, yeah. I, write, write that note. down. Write that down. Uh, was, the scientist said he has a good drug test story, so I was gonna let him tell it. I wanna hear mm. it. Okay, I hear so it. I had an official NCAA random drug test. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, God. And what, um, what, what had happened was, long story short, our athletic director loved pussy, so <laughs> he got fired. And they brought in a new head football coach, and he brought in this whole okay. new staff, and it's the end of spring training, and I get hit with a random, um, quote-unquote random, drug test. And I smoked every goddamn day from the morning to the fucking night. And me and my buddy, who we're going to call Roos... <laughs> we love to smoke weed and watch anime we were both on the the random drug test list so you jerk each other off too I thought you were gonna say oh, Roos was not only smoking weed Roos was on steroids as well <laughs> a lot of them a lot of them he was <laughs> jacked to shit he was jacked to uh -oh. shit but we rushed to Walmart buy a whole thing of cranberry juice like two gallons of water each go back to his dorm room his bathroom had a heater we're in sweat Wets, two hoodies and fucking trash bags with his heater on watching anime and fucking drinking cranberry juice and water and both taking turns pissing jesus christ yeah, cranberry juice so and you passed no but we'll get to that we'll get to that the day of the drug test comes and like it's a cold tennessee morning and my dick is shriveled I, I'm turtle shelling over here. I haven't shaved in three weeks, bro. And it's and it's one of those drug tests where they have to see you piss. Keep in mind, uh, I'm like 335 yeah, bro, pounds. Don't fuck around. Don't I'm, fuck around. I'm, I'm overweight. Like that's an understatement. So I go in there and I get this this old doctor, and he's like, "All right, son, you you have to, are you ready? It's your turn." And I'm. And bro, I had to piss so bad, but I got so nervous and like self-conscious about my dick. I didn't have, I couldn't pee anymore. And I, I was like chatting up with him like, yeah, man, I really got to go. And then I, we get behind there and he's just sitting there. I got my pants down to my thighs and he's just looking at my limp, shriveled dick with way too much pubic hair. And he's like, okay. And... <laughs> Nothing's happening. Okay. Uh, and, and then he turns away and says, he's like, you said you had to go. <laughs> and I stood there for three more minutes. No piss coming out until finally I found the strength to muster up a stream, hand him the sample, and he quickly ushered me out without saying a word. <laughs> She, that okay. Was so well, bad. I love the Hold accent up. you gave this guy. That was spot on. You said you had to go! <laughs> Spot on. For a oh. Tennessee football coach? No, this was a doctor! You... The doctor this was a doctor! Yeah. I had to go right, to right. a medical a doctor, okay, obviously. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. yeah. Sorry. What did you mean your old coach loved pussy? Can we go back to that? Yeah, okay. so yeah. What happened there? Let's our, circle back. Pussy. Our, our athletic director. So the head football coach at our school was also the athletic director, and he was like notorious for like, he was married, but he was no, like, he, there was a lot of rumors that he would fuck girls of the college, that he would fuck, uh, fuck like teacher professors, that he'd fuck other coaches. And he got caught. He just he, fucking other coaches. He got caught, he got caught fucking. Caught. He got caught pants down bare ass in one of the female locker rooms fucking the head softball coach just fucking back shots <laughs> what it was one of the wow. football coaches one of the other football coaches that fucking called him and snitched as well damn uh, we actually he probably had, had been uh, caught before right and just did not get snitched on yeah yeah, yeah he just didn't probably. get snitched. yeah he'd be yeah he'd been but like he was yeah <laughs> he was, he was uh, swinging dude, some dick how sure. are you the athletic director and the football coach like who can fire you at that point like, I don't even... <laughs> the trustee because there's a I mean, private school so the, like, the, the trustees are <laughs> like they had like the uh, president and the trustees of the school they had to meet and fire this guy oh my god yeah. i was gonna say like that's how you get away with fucking all the coaches <laughs> that's what i'm saying that's probably how 
did because he was power. like, "You fucking say anything, your job's gone." <laughs> yeah, <laughs> so, he had no, all so, uh, power being both. Jesus yeah. Christ! We, yeah. In my high school, we actually had. Uh, he wasn't the head coach. He was like the quarterbacks coach, you know, just one of the assistant coaches on the football team, mm-hmm. and he had like a pretty much relationship with a student. This dude's like in high school, upper forties years old. He's wow. quite literally grooming this teen girl, like fully admitted to. Like her parents found out, uh, other parents found out. People complained about it. Uh, they both basically came out and said, "Yeah, we like have this basic like relationship, but we've never hooked up. So you know, there's nothing wrong with it." Like. Yeah, she's under 18, but, like, we're not doing mm. anything, like, technically illegal. Oh, and it was this, like, whole mm. thing in our school. And then he ended up leaving because, like, all the parents were, like, pissed about it. But So they couldn't fi- – they thing. didn't fire him, though? He left. It was, like, a – I was think he, like, it was, forced like, to a, resign sort of thing? I think thing. it was, like, a forced <clears throat> leave. It can be really hard to fire Damn. teachers. Yeah. Depending on the really? situation. What I it can be though, really difficult. I think we need to pay them less, too. Really? No, yeah, sure. They get I'm paid not, way like, too much. I'm not making an argument. You know what's crazy? <laughs> like speaking of that, you know what's crazy about? We'll call him. We'll call his name's Frankie. Like shout out to like, you know he's a legend. Honestly, shout the fuck out to Frankie. But Frankie, they they he they let him resign. He didn't even get fired. He, he, wow. he let, they let him even do the resign. They let him step down out of respect just because he's like, that's the thing is he's like a legend at that school. He like built the program back to like a well, good winning program. Everybody, bro. <laughs> he was <just laughs> fucking everybody. Like, yeah, oh, like, damn. Yeah, dude. Like, we yeah. didn't want him to get, like, me and Sage were sad. Like, we love, we love Frankie. Bro, <laughs> we, we come back from Thanksgiving break. It's like our first team meeting. He's like, I'm stepping down from athletic director just to be your full time head coach. We were like, yeah. Oh, out. <laughs> and then a week later the athletic director walks in and like we have another team meeting and he's like yeah that son of a oh, bitch no. is gone we got rid of his ass <laughs> yeah, yeah i think with this guy funny. even went as far as to be like i think they even gave him the choice of like you got to stop doing what you're doing or you got to leave and i think he left holy um, so i had Jesus something Christ. very interesting going on at my high school it was the coach of the cross country team. He was uh, low thirties. I think he was like thirty three, and he was like he was like a heartthrob. Like all the girls loved him, and uh, he was also the teacher that was in charge of the senior Europe trip each year. And they would the seniors would graduate. They would go on the senior Europe trip, and he'd fuck all the eighteen year olds. And like they wait, all, all, it was all, after all, graduation. Holy yeah. Uh huh, and it was like this thing that Loki everyone knew about. Like, like you, like yeah, he was just fucking all of them. Like, I'm gonna tell you, I've look, heard one. I'm gonna tell you Joseph right Smith did it, buddy. That's I'm the greatest. Right. Yeah, there there there's not a lot of Mormons at this school. This isn't. This isn't L.A. There was. Uh, it was, uh, it wasn't there was like school. three Never of us. And, yeah, <laughs> I no. retract Area that. Could not be more gray. I just want to say, like, I'm so away with it. And the thing is, a little black. He was like, he, he was a, he was a good looking young guy. You know, you're like, damn, bro. He really do be in his low thirties looking chiseled as fuck. A coach of the cross country team, fucking all the 18 year olds. Do you like, want to fuck him? Why are you describing him <laughs> like this? Dude, <laughs> like you want to fuck him. Dude, he's like chiseled and handsome, dude. Say, like, I'm, I'm just glad, jealous of all the girls dude, got to fuck him. I am him. so glad that Hamzy is not a sports coach. Like, honestly, dude. Like, I'm uh, honestly, yeah. I'm glad. Uh, the mothers would not be that, safe. Yeah. That is yeah, true. I, I actually had, uh, speaking of lacrosse coaches, I actually had like a pretty situation with the lacrosse coach at and um, With you personally dude, or okay, like just like, he was like the male out, coach or the, the female coach? Male coach, dude. Listen, I, I, <laughs> wait, what? Like, I don't dude, trust lacrosse dudes. Wait first until of all. the end of the story. <laughs> yeah. but wait until In the, the south, the story, we call lacrosse as people who are going to play football. Legit, that's <laughs> everywhere, bro. That's basically, actually everywhere. Basically, I almost got registered as a sex offender. Listen oh. to the end of the story, okay? We already have one of those <laughs> so, on the Is this a bro? Patreon story, bro? Like, Dude, yeah. Okay, so it's, it's my senior year of high school, basketball season. I had literally just turned 18. This is like two weeks after my 18th birthday. And our team is in the playoffs. The home game, uh, we win. And me and my friends used to always go drunk to the games. A bunch of high schoolers being drunk. It was like a big thing to like hide being drunk, you know, gum, cologne, whatever, you know, that was like a big part of it. You never wanted to show that you're drunk. It's not like a, you know, professional sports game or college sports game. Like you got to really hide it. You got to be 
and and we got out of the game, dude. We were hyped. The game was over. I had to take a fucking piss. So, so, so bad. And I, on school property, on the side of the building, just take a piss. Like, on the side of the building. And uh... who turns the corner? The lacrosse coach. Who, one year prior, kicked me off of his team. So this guy's not the biggest Hamzy fan, you know? He, he doesn't Ooh. like me that much. And he sees me, he's like, what the fuck are you doing? And he's like, you're 18 years old, aren't you? You're going to be a sex offender. Yeah, we're going to get you in trouble. And <laughs> what I was like, the crazy thing to say. I was like, dude, please he, that, don't. He, he actually thought to himself, proudly, I'm going to make a sex offender. Like, he, he's oh, yeah. yeah. He's I'm going to ruin this kid's brown. life. It's like, 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 it's like you're a 45 year old man or something. You're literally 18. He's like, yeah. Oh, I'm gonna yeah. He, was like, he was like upper 30s or like 40 years old. But he was like, what prior, fuck? he would have been the sex offender. He's like, <laughs> yeah. you're, uh, he's like you're an adult pissing <laughs> on the school property. Like, you're going to be a sex offender. And I was like, dude, listen, man. Like, what the fuck do I need to do? And he's like, meet me after school Friday. Bring some gym shorts and running shoes. And I was like, oh, Bro, this, this sounds like a porno, gonna... bro. <laughs> yeah, bro, like, what the hell is this? this I was like, this guy, I was like, this guy's gonna fuck me up. And then <laughs> fuck your ass, I go, bro. I go, <laughs> I go meet him. I go to meet him and he's not showing up. And my best friend was the captain of the lacrosse team. And I get a text from my best friend being like, dude, he just told me like he's not able to meet with you because he's busy with some shit. Like he just said, like, watch your back. What the fuck? That's so weird. That's so Dude, weird. That guy's a like, fuck. Like posting up on an eighteen-year-old when you're like just trying to bully him. Fresh That's so yeah, weird. like it's just some weird like power fantasy from like an old dude. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. What do you he think? Not, what do you think he was gonna he have you like do? Me. You think he's gonna? You think he was gonna have you in there and just you know pull like, it out and be gym like, shorts and shoes. No, and no, no. He said bring we gym we shorts go and <laughs> don't wear underwear, boy. He said we were gonna go out on the track. Check out, and you're like, whoa. Holy shit. I don't know. I mean, I think he's gonna pull out the Hydra and Seacock monster. Like, what do you think is gonna happen, bro? I I was thinking he was just gonna probably run me on the track till I puke, which honestly doesn't take much for me. So like. Yeah, you're professional. Yeah. That certainly yeah. beats you. Being got a couple of 99 bananas. That would be funny, shoes like, if pocket, he made you start dude. running and you're like literally halfway through one lap, you just stop and start puking. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, oh, well, well, fuck. He's, yeah. well, shit. All right, man, you're good. You're good, man. Yeah. You're, you just keep throwing up. Like, yeah. <laughs> it's so funny. Yeah, uh, I don't know. He also, he already didn't like me, dude. I got kicked off the lacrosse team like one year before. So, I mean, it wasn't like we weren't in. Wait, wait, why did he kick you? Why did he kick you off? Uh, I got in a fight. In <laughs> He's school. like, oh, I it's fucked the... his daughter. We're like, it was oh. the... <laughs> nah, nah. I wasn't like a fighter or anything. It was I, I got in one fight in school in my entire life, and it was like the lacrosse team had apparently had too many kids on it. Like they'd brought too many <coughs> kids onto the team, and so they had to make this round of cuts. And it was kind of fucked up. They were like, we had everyone make the team, and then they're like, sorry guys, we actually like had too many people on the team. We're gonna do like a round of cuts. So like this next two weeks of practice is gonna be really intense. Uh, like twenty of you guys are getting cut off the team. That's so mean. So, Jesus. Yeah, yeah. It was already fucked up. Uh, I mean, it wasn't like it, like really their fault. I think it was like more of a funding thing. Um, and it was during that period, and I got in a fight in school. Uh, basically, I was at the cafeteria. I was sitting down. These two kids had nothing to do with me. They're they're sitting in front of. They're they're standing up, and they get into an argument. They start pushing each other back. Uh, they're all getting like start. They start getting real physical. I'm literally sitting here. It's Taco Tuesday. I love tacos. And, and they, uh, <laughs> I'm literally and sitting like, here on a Taco Tuesday. <laughs> they start bumping into the table, bumping into me. I'm like, guys, I'm enjoying my tacos. Like, just like whatever you do, like, don't get this shit on me. And like one of the guys took that as like a challenge, I guess, and literally just took my taco off of my tray and just dumped it on my shirt. Aww. And I just what? got straight. I got Man. straight. I, I, like straight from my seat i just like knocked this kid out with one shot <laughs> and i got suspended from school for one day and then i got kicked off the lacrosse team and then i ended Aww. up fighting that kid in a backyard like two weeks later did you, you win? win that one yeah 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 of course he did right. good for oh, you cool. that's crazy yeah that's insane i feel like yeah that's definitely one of those non-negotiable fight things if someone like <laughs> takes your food and destroys it in front of you like you have to uh, sometimes you have to dude 
You just have to. You just yeah, have yeah. to. I feel like, like that or that someone spitting on you. That shit never happened to me, dude. What, going... what kind of schools you guys going to? <laughs> oh, no, no. This stuff public never schools. happened. I'll, this stuff school, never happened. Yeah, right. I went to public school, man. <laughs> no, you didn't, bro. <laughs> I did go to public school. You went to school, West dude. Elliott Schnapp Love private school, bro. <laughs> 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 I saw you there. Yeah. Nah, nah, nah. This wasn't. I, I went to the kind of school where, like, if someone ever got in a fight, it was, like, a big deal and people were talking about it for, like, weeks. Uh, it was not like a. It was not. That was like always a, so much fun, dude. When a fight happened yeah, in school, that was like oh, the drama. Gosh. Yeah. Dude, if if you like witnessed it too, if you're like the person, like you yeah, know, yeah. So I, that was cool. I, that I got was some deep. street cred out of it, you know, because it was at lunch. It was in front of like the whole school, so like I guess there was that. Yeah. Positive. You are cool. Damn. Yeah, I was gonna say. I remember I told the story before at my school. Like fought my freshman. My freshman year, it was cool to fight because I, I got in a fight my freshman year. We were playing basketball. It was just a pickup game, and I punched this kid in the face and. His nose bled and they like broke up or whatever, you know. And then we 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 dapped it up after, and like I got I, I got in school suspension for a couple of days. And then the next year they changed the policy for the county that any fighting at all, automatic alternative school, like anything, Ooh. any any like punches actually thrown, forty day minimum if you actually throw punches. <laughs> That's like so the next year this kid was like school. fucking talking shit like trying to bully me and my friend. This kid's like like I told the story. He's like a this really small kid and I picked him up and like chucked him across the room. 20 days the last 20 days of my fucking sophomore year of fucking high school i had to go to the alc the alternative learning oh, center oh no yeah the ALC. assholes last chance that's what we called it yeah Damn. <laughs> that's good <laughs> wear the stupid polo i was shocked and it, it was funny so i tried to you can like dispute it <laughs> with the with the school board and bro they showed up with the evidence this is like a fucking court case they showed like this is his hoodie they had a fucking like they had a photo of his hoodie where it was like kind of ripped <laughs> like put it on the table bro i was like are you fucking serious bro i What's was like fucking dweeb <laughs> i was like come on man anyway whoever that principal was that reviewed that shit <clears throat> fuck you <laughs> yeah, fuck you. I'm, I'm still salty. Yeah, I bet that kid much. used a satchel. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm still salty. <laughs> school fights. Uh, right. School fights were Let's so. Let's calm funny. down, Nine Rain. There's nothing yeah. wrong. Yeah, that's the thing too. You know what they? You know the audacity? They're like, they're like, you have to apologize to him. And I was like, can I get out of alternative school if I do that? And they're like, no. And I was like, then fuck him. I'm not apologizing <laughs> yeah. to this guy. Fuck you guys. Like you're sending me regardless. I'm not apologizing. <laughs> did you guys oh, have? Uh, did you guys have like an area where people would go? Like they would like schedule fights and fight after school. Like they. Oh yeah. Yeah, there was a park, local park. Courtyard. Yeah, yeah, local park. Um, it was next to like a very like secluded gas station called the Black Dog Market. <laughs> That's where the people oh, throw it down at. Name. The Black Dog Market. Black Dog Market. Oh, dog! I thought it was dog. Yeah. I was like, owners That's... didn't give a fuck. People were like, they yeah, they like, like a huge, like a huge lot in the back where people just hang out, like all the kids with their trucks <laughs> and shit. You know, the Kona. Just hanging out, but yeah, that's where the that's where to go down at for sure. The KK Kona, just like dude, I was like, <laughs> <laughs> maybe a couple of them were affiliated. I'm not gonna lie. I was like, whoa. <laughs> he hit yeah. the first two pretty hard. I didn't know he was finishing it with Ona. There's like, like yeah, there's like some gonna... kids from <laughs> like the Franklin area, which is like nice that would go the went to my school. And then you have like the rural, you know, country kids. It's like a big Something mixture. Rural. Yeah, there's yeah. a lot going on there, but yeah. Wait, yeah, can I did... go back for a sec? Yeah, what's mm -hmm. up? Yeah. When ha Hamzy was talking about being a sex offender, and that just reminded me. Did y'all see the Disney <laughs> streaker? No. no, I did. In in I small world, this, but I didn't hear it. Tell yeah, me. Yeah, there was small a guy world? that went on. Yeah, it's a small world, and I've seen a bunch of different POVs oh, of this. Oh yes. And I guess he was just on a fuck ton of drugs, probably acid. Mm -hmm. oh, he, he was gets off the a, Have you been on It's a Small World? There's like a bunch of yeah. like, didn't you know, we go on like that? dolls. Did we go on that ride? ride? We, we did go some... on that ride. We did, yeah, I remember, because we were you know fucked. How you're on the boats, <laughs> yeah. and you know, it just kind of like, yeah. It just it says sick. the same song over and over again. Yeah, so silly. he gets up, and he is like, like touching the heads of the dolls, and he sits down in like the fake water, and he's wearing nothing but underwear at this point. And the security is like yelling at him, and a flashlight's on him, and he's just so clearly like tripping balls because he is just like, what is going on? He's just like trying to get comfy. And then that video cuts off, and then there's another video that's taken from outside the ride. Like the ride kind of like peeks out into like the open air for a second. And he's right there, completely butt ass naked, in just like wading in the water, like splashing <laughs> around. And a security guard is like trying to get over to him. And then that video cuts out. And the next video I saw was these four security guards that are literally holding him like 
he is horizontal and they have him <laughs> handcuffed behind his back. There's two guys on one side in the front and two guys on one side in the back. He is butt ass naked, but they have a towel over his back. But you can like still see in the shot. You can like see his like dick and like his balls and his butt a little bit from the back. That is crazy. Oh yeah. Anyways, Damn. this guy just like was completely butt ass naked in the middle of Disneyland. Like he's a sex offender for life. I mean, dude, was, if you're tripping sure. balls, that is the ride you want to be on. <laughs> I know. That's actually true. That's what that guy say, thought too. But I was going to say, well poor yeah. Disney security, they're not paid enough to handle no. a fucking naked man no, on the dude. fucking bro. I would have been, I would have walked in there and seen him like not. waiting in the water. I'm like, I'm good, bro. I'm out, bro. I'm like, you got like, I'm, I'm taking my he PTO. He does the Highlander <laughs> bad guy like spin and go beneath the water. Oh, You're like, dude. nah, I'm not chasing him. You get in there. I know, it's like, fuck yeah. bro. You're I'll just tripping balls. You turn that corner, you see the little dolls dude it's yeah. a small oh it would be over oh, yeah, oh, yeah. I'm out, bro. wait wait yeah it's all quiet you can just kind of hear like it's a small yeah. you just oh. like I would have got an injury. <laughs> I would have fell. I would have just fell over and like hurt myself. You, you like see a shadow move, hear a splash. You're like, what the fuck? You look over, there's some clothes on the ground. You're like, my God. Dude, I'm that sending you guys the videos sick. from the outside. Please, yes. That's, oh, yeah, insane. put them in After Dark. Yeah. Oh, my God. God, but there's a ton of kids too. Fucking. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, too bad for them. That's, oh, that's no, not cool. Dude. Like, oh, oh, man. Yo, did he shit himself or has he got a hairy ass? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, let me see this shit. Oh my oh, I think god. He shit himself. It's gotta be shit, right? Oh yeah, for oh, sure. No. Oh this, my totally god. Shit. Oh, this is ugh. he totally shit himself. Bro, is that Daniel Dude, that, Radcliffe? Close, yeah. This fucking guy is dressed as a fucking elf trying to block the view of the children from the naked guy being gay, bro. He's like, no. Oh, man. Oh, God. Bro. This is like that's a just a hairy fight, ass. Bro. bro, it looks like Daniel Radcliffe, bro. Is that Harry Potter? Holy oh, fuck. Oh, my God. Wow. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. And they, this guy's just like legit. gonna come to in a prison, and just, they're just gonna tell him what he did. And they're just gonna be like, God damn it, bro! Oh no! <laughs> oh yeah, hundred percent. Oh god! He's like grabbing onto the dolls. Dude, the oh, wow, the po the pose, the like posture of him when he's getting carried is all like scorpion Dude. with his dick swinging. That's just a, just think about this though. No one no one's going to Disneyland alone. This guy's got a group and his group probably done some drugs <laughs> too. Mm. Oh no, this, if anybody friends, goes to bro? Disneyland alone, it's this fucking dude. <laughs> like, yeah. Yeah. He probably spun through Wait, the turn this... side, howled and like sprinted off. Was this Disneyland? Oh, it was a Disney World. Is it the, this the Orlando one here? I think Disney World. No, I think it's is... California. Okay, it's California. Just they just have the same ride. Okay. Yeah. I mean, listen, dude. Oh, okay. uh, I'm not. I'm not really about databases, but if there's any group of people they should what? keep a database on, it's oh. definitely people who go to Disney World alone. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, you can't go alone. As, bro. An, as an adult, yeah, you can. Yeah. You need at least one person. At least one person to go. There's no yeah. way you go by yourself. It's there's no way. It would just be. I'd be at sad. Entry, I'd feel. Yeah, when you feel, I'd feel. I'd feel bad. Like I'd feel so yeah, sad. That would be such a, like a dissociative experience where you just yeah. kind of like walk around looking at shit, like families <laughs> smiling at each other, other people like. like hanging you know out. what? I take it back, dude. I would actually go. I like. I never went alone, but we used to live right <laughs> oh next to God. it, and we had the passes, bro. Shut and, up. Like, we would just go. <laughs> like just two fancy of a us turkey usually. leg. Yeah, no, we would just go for dinner sometimes that's because what, it I mean, was that just... would be the only exception if you okay, got well, a pass and you Holy could get fuck, a little grub. Yeah. That makes so sense. I'm not, to giving, me. I'm not giving you any exceptions. I'm I went not. to the went to the Renaissance Fair with Max. I had a really good time. That was fun. Dude, was actually, the Ren was... Fest is fun. As Wait, which Ren one? Fest is sick as fuck. Especially yeah. that one. That was pretty. That was upscale. That was upscale. Okay, I went to Texas Ren Fair like two weekends ago. It's the one in Houston. Is wait they have it too? Wait, yeah. Oh my god, I gotta look up when they do. It's huge, actually. The one in Houston is really good. Dude, it was fun. We got the comedian. We had the turkey leg. They had all these fun games, like cool. But the, the t tomato oh, man, guy. Okay. There's a guy who's just months. he's just roasting oh, the that fuck, guy. just roasting the fuck out of people trying to throw tomatoes at him. Dude, he's dude. good. He is decimating no, he was, them. He was really yo, yo, fucking he's decimating them. We had one you of had a tomato guy. Job. Yeah, we had a tomato guy in Texas, and he was fucking. Dude, there was a kid dude. that he was like blasting, and I was like, dude, this kid, <laughs> like he said the word cock and semen like 
10 times in front of the, and I'm like, the parents are standing right there. And I'm like, yeah, dude, get him out this of here. Guy there's a, there's a sign that's the like, this is an R-rated exhibit. Yeah, yeah, the dude was yeah, ruthless. Like, that. old ladies are trying to throw, and he's like, you old bitch. Your tits don't even work, do you? Yeah. You can't even move yeah. those fucking things. Dude. He's just fucking laying yeah, into dude, like, some, oh, what some a, old what guy. What a sick job to have, bro. I, know, yeah, I think that's the last, that's, that's where the last Republicans are going to go. Is the red fair <laughs> no, tomato dude. guy? Like that's, yeah. when it all comes down, that's gonna be the last place where you can say whatever shit you want to say. What is yeah. this tomato. What there guy? was an old guy at our tomato thrower who had like an American flag T-shirt. Yeah, and, the and he like hat. missed really hard. He had a veteran <laughs> hat. He missed really hard, and he's like, "You look like you don't use sunscreen because it says apply liberally." And like people, people oh, fucking locked it. Dude. That's, that's <laughs> funny. Uh, it was, dude. Good. It was really funny. He's it's like, wait, he's like. Where'd you serve at? The desk? Look at that arm or something like that. <laughs> yeah, oh, where like... did you serve at? Denny's? Yeah. He's <laughs> yeah. Like... Oh my god. Yeah, that guy was ruthless. He was Tomato hilarious. That's sick. Yeah, and then he yeah, roasted us good. too. Like we were just sitting there laughing, watching. He fucking roasted us too. He made fun of us. He was Catch yeah. Stray. It was good. Yeah, That's we did good. catch a stray. Um Damn. Yeah. Ugh. Well, in the spirit of what Nine Rant said, do you guys want to do the Twitter workshop? Yeah, I'm down. Yes. I, I think I have some. Yeah. I've, I've actually got one today. I don't know if I'm going to tweet it. I so. already tweeted today, and it was kind of a banger. So, uh, But I do have one. I did bring one today. I, I, somebody can have it. <laughs> I tweeted. It was shout to Sin Furnace. She just posted those Spotify things. I posted the 600,000 minutes of uh, peer, peer pressuring kids to do uh, cigarettes. And actually I to smoke cigarettes. <laughs> I, was oh, a, yeah, I, was, I, I saw that. I was like, I'm tweeting this. This is a banger. <laughs> That is a banger. Um, also, Spotify rap. That's yeah. Spotify, Spotify rap is just like Thanksgiving, bro. We're all having the same thing. Why we all? No one can, stop sharing it. I saw like fifty of those a day, man. I was. Yeah, it was hurting. Mine's, like, mine's embarrassing. I like I'm not seeing them. Mine. Okay, I like seeing that's your guys's, good. but not yeah, everybody else. Yeah, so that's else. the thing. Like, if it's your good <laughs> friend, you're like, hey, there. Yeah. But like for Twitter, yeah. that's like way too public of a. I mean, not too public, but like ninety nine percent of the people are gonna be like. No. I'm being pessimistic. Sorry. Yeah, it's yeah. okay. We know. Um, uh, I have one drop this this week. Send it. Uh, people always ask me, "Can I get a bond? How about you get a bond with your family and get a fucking job?" <laughs> <laughs> Is that good? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, I think I can't tell if the delivery was just really good or what, but I laughed. Uh, I was gonna say I, I saw it coming and I still giggled. Which is how are you fun. going to? Uh, how are you gonna like phrase it? Because I feel like the delivery on Twitter is important too with that one because it's kind of it's a little longer. Screenshot sure, that's how formatting. I typed it. Formatting yeah. is important. Plus the the ending, like just it was, was like, like an emoji bond with too. Your family and get a job <laughs> like that, that i think that makes it even better it's like oh yeah also get a job you piece of shit like <laughs> maybe I throw like a heart that. after that maybe let me see no heart no i would put i would put a, I would put a, oh, I would put a, a full emoji. line between good. the can i get a bond and the rest you think so i don't know mm. i mean like hit like hit enter and put it under it yeah, so, yeah. just like put enter yeah, yeah that, that'd be fine yeah okay that's good. Um, I've I've got a fucking dude, I've got a rough one today. I don't know if I'm gonna tweet this. Okay. It's not. It's pretty bad. <laughs> um, <laughs> okay. Spit it out. You got Sorry. it, man. She's a it's not good. It's, 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 it's not good. It's not good for you. Uh, people say white privilege is real, but I've tried suicide by cop nine times. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's horrible. And, and then you like, oh, just so leave it at bad. that. But I mean, that's good. just that. Damn. <laughs> like, I like the idea is good, but I didn't laugh. It's, I don't know. It's yeah, just, it's, it's more of like, like a oh. ah. Yeah. It's just like yeah, ah. That's, like a that's what, that's it's, what, it's, that's what it's supposed to do. You're it's not little, supposed to it's, laugh. It's a little dark. I like it. I think I have. I think I have one tasty that I think fits your brand a little bit. It's a nice. Yeah, yeah. Something that I can't. I'm not gonna tweet that. Yeah. This is a nice easy one. <laughs> Damn, girl, you're looking hella humanized today. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Humanized. I do kind of like that. Yeah, what does it mean? I got that one. I, yeah, I got that one. I went over my head. <clears throat> I don't know. Because, um, you know, like, you know, like dehumanizing women. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you know? I, yeah. It's not It's not reading for me. Nah. Can I, I throw I, mine I, out? It's, it's like, yeah. okay. I'll just go in gallery. It's already tweeted today, but I'm going to throw this one out. It was, uh... 
<laughs> I mean, it's pretty basic. It's also RuneScape too, so that might help. It's just hope they add back shots to the Coliseum. It's a little Oscar awesome tweet. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I kind of uh, like it. Yeah. That's not bad. I like yeah. that. I have. Can I? Idea. Should I? Oh. Should, wait. Okay. Should I post my one from last week where it said? Um, Sorry to hear about your dog passing away at 15 years of age. That's crazy. Do you have any videos of you farting really loudly? <laughs> <laughs> I like didn't, that one. Didn't yeah, Amzie read that one? Or did you read that one? That would be good. No, that, <laughs> uh, that was, was you. Did you tweet that? Hey, was that in Somebody read that. To no, that was Krylax. Krylax, Krylax, no, Krylax he, read that. Krylax no, read that last week. That. I'm telling you, it was Krylax. Or did did Krylax give you? Though? Did he give you that, though? Because he told me that one, too. I think I gave him that. I don't know. Or no, no, no. He had something slightly different. I think we both saw the same source material on TikTok. Yeah. And then, like, wrote our own. I think that's what we did. Okay. Sound familiar. Um, I don't <clears> know. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. that one. I have, I put the cum in compassion. <laughs> <laughs> I like that's that good. one. That's, that's a banger. Nice. I don't know. I don't really have it. Um, uh, mine is pussy from a girl that's got feet like bloat. And then you take this picture. <laughs> I just post it. I posted it. And then you. <laughs> bro, oh my God. God. that is unreal. <laughs> oh no. Oh, Say this, no. please. Oh, Say this, no. please. Show the picture. Yeah, please stand. Oh, no. oh, God. What the fuck, dude? Oh, that's <laughs> bro. You can't tell me that ain't Beggar's feet right there, bro. How'd you get a picture of Beggar's feet? That's crazy. <laughs> Oh uh, wow, that's something. Huh? So here's the question: Do I crop that picture, or do I uh, just leave that how it is, how it's kind of been stolen, stolen, it, stolen from I would leave it story. I would leave it. I think yeah, it's shit. You're shit posting. You can't. Yeah, don't get to. Don't think too much. I just rip it. Um, all right, Damn. and then. Uh, well, then another one is: I got burgers in my ass. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? Why would you tweet that? As burgers. As burgers. As burgers. I got you, bro. I mean, that hit me immediately. That was funny. I don't, I don't <laughs> you have to spell like B E R G E R S. Okay. I will, uh, that, that, that one will come at a later date. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to save my Coliseum one for later, maybe. We'll see. Damn. All right, then I'll do the. <laughs> Hams, he really liked it, bro. He's just enjoying that a lot, bro. It's because he has ass from a girl burgers, who got feet like bloat. I like that one, dude. Feet <laughs> like bloat. Oh, that was that's good. a banger. Dude, my cat. I'm so sorry. <laughs> it's okay. Oh, that's that's good content. Uh, I thought well, I, I thought content, I had I one, but I was I, I apparently did not save it. Oh, you did not. No, I don't. You nah, could do I'll the rip. one that I told you today. Nine rain the type of guy to hide pickles under his tongue. Dude, what the hell? <laughs> what does that mean? Uh, uh, from SpongeBob. That's a SpongeBob, a SpongeBob reference. Oh. Fucking, what's that guy's name? Bubble, <laughs> bubble Bass. Bubble Bass. <laughs> bubble Bass. Yeah. God damn. Do we send I it do, yet? <laughs> Sorry. Oh, are we tweeting? I have not. Are we Three, tweeting? We'll tweet. 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 Two, tweet. one, tweet. Bam. <laughs> nice. Oh, by the way, we are having Mr. Cincy Bearcat on the Patreon cast today. Oh, yay. Um, he's, he's coming on to talk to us. Uh, up and coming, hot, physically and um, with heat, streamer. <laughs> he's coming He's coming on to uh, talk to us. And uh, Nine Rain is also going to tell his story about how he ended up at a swingers party and participated at no, Twitch no, no, Las Vegas. No. Well, it was a swingers <laughs> BDSM party. And okay. Like, okay. Oh uh, my god! Find out on the Patreon. No more. Yeah. Say no more. And it was Say like no a real one, like Say top no. tier. So. Yeah. But then Olive just showed up out of nowhere. Just came out of the tent. It was crazy. We'll get yeah. into it. We'll get He's into got it. a harness on. There bro. was a teepee. Yeah. All right. So, uh, Tasty, take us out. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for tuning into this episode 22 of Based After Dark. If you would like to hear about Mr. Nine Rain's BDSM swinger sex party featuring, but not limited to, Olive, tune into the Patreon. You get one week free subscription. Don't skip, we have some news for you because we have recently reworked our entire podcast format. We will still be conducting one normal podcast a week, but now Tier 1 patrons will have access to a weekly exclusive Patreon podcast that's going to be even more based and more after dark. We've also updated our other tiers to include perks that allow you to directly interact with the podcast and influence the topics that we speak about. The Patreon will be linked in the description below.